Moving right along, now I'm gonna switch over to the Maps app. And the first thing that we're gonna look at is the new facility layer. So I am going to open the Maps app. Yep, I'm gonna leave that without saving. Thanks for reminding me. And if I go to add layer, you'll see that the new, we have a new addition, it's the facilities layer. So I'm gonna click on the facility layer. And in this layer, we're going to be able to disaggregate or indicate our various facilities by different organizational unit groups or group sets. So let's first turn on the country and then let's go down to our facility level, turn those on. And here we see our various uh, groups. Let's look at just the clinics. And then we're gonna go over to the style tab. And this is where we can organize them by group sets. So I am now going to turn on the group set. Let's just look at facility ownership. And I'm going to uh, add this layer. And here you see all of the various facilities in Sierra Leone. And their indication, their icon, indicates the facility ownership. If we look at the key up here, we see that we have mission, NGO, private clinic, and public facilities. You see that the vast majority of them are public facilities, but if we zoom in to this area here, we'll change this to OSM detail, make it a little bit more interesting to look at. Uh, if I zoom in, then you see that I actually have some facilities that are, this one here is a, a private clinic, um, and there, um, there are some others, there's another private clinic. But anyways, you're just essentially able to um, then uh, disaggregate or visualize your map um, for the facilities based upon various groups that you, that you put them into. All right, a pretty simple feature, but it really does help um, uh, get a, a clearer idea of the various facilities types that you have uh, in your country especially for that master facility list use case that we're trying to work towards.